think I will take him down, I will knock him out, I will hug him, I will just point fight. I don't give a f There's no way this man's coming over to my home soil and taking everything I've worked for. I try to knock your head off. Let's Serious. cut the bull. He's a kickboxer, he's a good kickboxer, but this is MMA. We're in the historic city of Newcastle, England, ahead of PFL Europe 1, the first league event. Simeon Powell and Mohamed Amin, they don't like one another. They've been going back and forth all week on social media. Now we get to see who has the last word. We are hours away from this becoming the home of the smart cage of the PFL. PFL Europe 1 is taking place in this very arena. And I'm sitting with the main event across the table from one another right now. And it's been, it's been a bit fiery between you two guys. Like we did a, a media day a few weeks ago and you were smiling and trash talking a bit, but then today, not many smiles today. It's like game faces are on. Mo, tell me about how you're feeling now. It's time to get serious, right? And what's that mean for you? Beat each other up. Beat each other up. So you're expecting a hard fight? Yeah. Are Good. you gonna give him a hard fight? I think he's he a, knows that, he knows that. I think he's a smart guy, he's I think smart. he trained hard. I think you turned out for this fight. It's, yeah, bro, there's respect there. There's got to mm. be. There's got to be, but he, he knows this ain't going to be easy. He knows, he knows. It's, it's different. It's a different game he's in. So you're both excellent kickboxers. This is a mixed martial arts fight. Are we going to get a kickboxing match or is one of you going to try and surprise the other one with some, uh, some other mixed martial arts skills? He knows. I'm comfortable everywhere. I think he's going to shoot. Oh, really? Yeah. Okay. Maybe. <laughs> Okay, so how do you beat Simeon? With all my, with, with all my skill set, man. Which is kickboxing predominantly. Have you been adding new things yeah, to your game? I've been MMA fighting now for almost Let's two cut years. Uh, yeah, he's, he's a kickboxer. Uh -huh. he's, he's got a kickboxing fight for weeks. He's in kickboxing mode. He's coming to kickbox. Do you know what I mean? Let's just cut the bullshit. I hope he's been doing his training properly because this will be an easy fight for me if he hasn't. Do you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. But. He's a kickboxer, he's a good kickboxer, but this is MMA and I hope he's done his homework. And you seem annoyed that he's got another fight booked after this one. A bit disrespectful, he thinks like he can what, run through me and then go, go do another fight. Nah, that's not, when people fight me, that's not how it happens, you know what I mean? That's not, they don't, they don't fight four weeks later, do you know what I mean? Who's been around you for this training camp? I've heard some big names have been in your uh, camp supporting you. I don't like name dropping, but my brothers, I have uh, Rani De Ridder, I have Musasi, I have uh, some guys from Bellator, some guys from UFC even, a lot of kickboxers from, mm. uh, from Glory. So I'm pretty confident. And how do they think you're going to win the fight? Have they given you a prediction? Have I they think everybody's you expecting a finish because uh, we both have a high finish rate, so I don't think there will, uh, will be points. Mm. Yeah, no, yeah, that's what I mean. It's exciting. This fight is exciting. Like, it brought the best out of me. Mm -hmm. I'm not gonna stand there and tell you, like, pretend this gonna be easy. Do you know what I mean? I'm not that guy. I'm not stupid. Do you know what I mean? But he brought the best out of me, and trust me, like, the fans are in for a treat. I'm glad to hear that. I'm ready for everything. Like he said, every fight he fights different. Then he tries to clinch, then he tries to throw knees, then he tries calf kicks, then he tries to shoot. So we're, we're ready, but I fight every fight different. I try to, get, I try to knock your head off, of course. <laughs> that's, my, uh, that's my basic. But like he said, he also brought the best out of me. Because a big stage, main event. Don't want to disappoint my people. I won't. There's no way this man's coming over to my home soil and taking everything I've worked for. I've sacrificed too much. And there's no way this man's taken what I've, what I've earned. How was the motivation after media day? After you saw each other? Because there was some conversation about height, you know, six foot five, six foot four. I think that you was were saying. Yeah, you said it was I, looking down on me, but you saw, uh -huh. you, saw, you saw the face off? Yeah. I think I'm a bit taller. You see this thing, man, he's an Instagram boy, man. He's, he, loves, <laughs> he loves Instagram, you know what I mean? I'm like, I don't give a shit about all of that. I don't even watch his videos and that. I'm sure he stalks me, I know he does, but he's an Instagram boy, he's a pretty boy, man. Mm -hmm. Do you know what I mean? You watch these fights, right? You've seen these fights, you've done yeah. your research. Yeah. What do you think? I think kickboxing-wise, mm -hmm. he's solid. Do you yeah. know what I mean? Can't deny that. But um, MMA, I ain't seen a lot. 
and I'm truly, and I feel like he had one tough opponent and he lost in MMA, you know what I mean? But he's a seasoned vet in kickboxing and I'm sure he's experienced. But MMA, I don't think he's had that test. How's that make you feel? Is he the one to test you in MMA? We will see. He knows, he knows. We will see. He knows. We will see. If he, he doesn't fumble, we will see. He knows. I don't we'll fumble see. nothing, we'll bro. We will see. I don't fumble nothing. We will see. Not where I'm from. I don't fumble nothing. Trust me. So t talk to me about this format, right? Because you know if you win this week and then you move on to the semi-finals and then you're into the finals, you'll be the first champion of PFL Europe. Of course, that both, you're both chasing that same goal. What, what makes you the one that's going to get that? Yeah, it's going to sound cliche. I'm the hardest worker. I'm more, I'm more scale-wise, blah, blah, blah. But I will just do it. I can talk all, I can talk all the talk, but I'm just going to do it. Easy. How do you feel about his confidence? Have you had an opponent that's been as confident in front of you like this before? No, no, he's probably my first. But like, I can, I can see the belief. He believes in himself, and he's gonna bring it. And I know he's fight. He's, he's. A, I can tell he's a man that fights for. He's got a purpose. Do you know what I mean? But I do too. And I'm cut from a different cloth. And I tell you, I sacrifice daily. And nothing was handed to me. Nothing. I've worked my whole life for this point here, do you know what I mean? So I'm just going to get in there, do what I do, and that's that. So how do you picture it in your mind? I win by however method I would choose. I take it, I will dictate the fight. Everywhere it goes will be on my terms. How do you deal with the unknown? Uh, how, how do you deal with not knowing exactly what your opponent's going to do? What I said, be prepared for everything. I don't, I don't train just kickboxing. We do everything. I train with the best guys, with the best MMA guys in the world. You think we only do kickboxing? <laughs> it's not that easy, bro. It's not that easy. So, how do you plan on getting to the top in kickboxing? Hmm? How do you plan on getting to the top in kickboxing? You'll see. Just give everything. Sacrifice a lot. Be in the gym, spend hours, bleed. Mm. That's how you get the bit to be the best. You're talking to the wrong man, man. I know this. But juggling two sports, you, you can't. You can't. You just can't physically put all you've got into MMA if you're a kickboxer mm. and you are still an active kickboxer in glory, high level, there is no way, there's no way you put the same amount of work into MMA as me. There's no way. So he's, he's confident because he feels like your attention's divided between two sports. I think he wants some, uh, he said that he wants some petty because he trains a lot. He says he, he's made from a different club. I don't think he's made from a different club. I'm made from a different club because I, I fight in MMA. Highest position and kickboxing in high position. I'm different. You're not different. I like that too. I give him that. <laughs> <laughs> Even that, but hey, look, my record speaks for itself. And it's quality, and not quantity. Yeah? I don't what care. I've don't done. care if you, quality, if you go like quality, 40 hours in the gym quality, and everything. Quality, it it's not the same. Quality in the cage. It's not the yes. same. Yeah, we will my see in the cage. We'll my see my the opponents, cage. I've beat and I've put away. Don't even compare to your opponents. You got good chances. Bro, you fight, it's different. It's you different. Fight it's different. Bums in a ring, bro. You fought once in a cage. What are you gonna do? I've been in that cage. I've teared through people. You fought in a ring against cab drivers. How can you compare? How can your MMA resume compare? Your only good opponent was your last opponent, the undefeated guy. And look what I've done to him. Yeah, but the, he has no fighters out. The rest, the rest of the guys, they brought for you. People brought the guys for you. I guys with I negative records, they brought for you. Don't, don't, I've, don't never, I've only fought one man with a negative so don't record. Talk, don't talk. I fought don't one talk, man with... Talk. Let's start, let's talk facts. I've only fought one man with a negative record. I fought five days notice a man and I knocked him out. Get your facts right. I've been in that cage, I've taken risks and I've come out on top. <laughs> You have not taken no risk in MMA. 
And the one risk you did, you fumbled the bag. Don't fumble this one. That's right, Mir. Who's got the best conditioning? Me! The guy gasses out every fight. Is that true? Is that his perspective correct? No. Come on, brother. Talk the truth. So who can dig you the deepest? You got the gas then? tank. I got the gas tank. The you sure? Who can go five? Yeah, make it five. Yeah. Can you get a contract? <laughs> you can go five. Do it. I've done a five rounder, so yeah. We can do five. Against cab drivers. Cab drivers, come on, man. Come on, man. You know them kids. This guy's not a cab driver. Them, 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 them MMA nah, fights nah, 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 nah. in a ring. Okay, okay. Them MMA fights in a ring. Come on, man. Come on, brother. If you had to do my job and commentate on this fight, what's the best part of his game that I'm looking out for? What am I going to be excited about as a fan when Simeon's fighting? What do you like watching about him as a fan? It's like marriage counselling. <laughs> <laughs> I would tell you boys to separate straight away. Uh, what I like about, uh, about him. Hmm. Yeah, he's a young guy, he's hungry. So uh, he leaves it all in the ring. I think I respect that. Uh -huh. That's what I respect. He's not afraid to fight. That's what I respect. Uh -huh. That's it. What about you? Same question. Yeah. Yeah, I, likewise, I think he's hungry. And like I said, he's got a purpose. I can see that. And what's the message for the, to the rest of your division from this performance this weekend? What, what message do you want to give to the other light heavyweights? I feel like, my true opinion, once I get through Mo, this, this should have been the final. Okay. Yep. Yeah? <laughs> yeah. The division, once I get the through him, the division is not well, that great. Yeah, the I don't, honestly, honestly I, once I get through him, I feel like I clean out everyone. So, yeah. Do you agree? Is he the next best fighter in the division aside from you? In Europe? Yes. Yeah? Yeah. In Europe, yes. You're walking out Saturday night, what's the emotion? This is what we, what we live for. Opportunities like this showcase the world what we're made of. Showcase the whole division what we're made of. And is it important for you to show him that you've got mixed martial arts skills because he's saying you're just a kickboxer? I've got nothing to prove to him. I have everything to prove to myself. I don't care what he thinks. He can think I will take him down, I will knock him out, I will hug him, I will just point fight. I don't give a f I just need to win. Main event Saturday. Any nerves yet? Yeah, I'm cool. Yeah? This is fun. You smooth? I'm smooth. You cool? I'm cool. Yeah? Yeah. Can't wait. Good luck, gentlemen. Thank you, sir. You don't want to miss this. March 25th, the Virtue Motors Arena. PFL Europe 1 is the start of something incredible. Make sure you watch it live on DAZN.